Hi, welcome to the MadCenter.com. In this video, we are continue from where we are going to continue from where we left off the last time. Uh, the problem involving uh, some differentiation. Uh, before that, right? This is a quick reminder. We are looking at the Pearson and Excel International GCSE uh, for the maths paper, uh, paper one R, yeah? and the subject code is four PM one. Another subject reference is 4pm1 slash 4mr. Before we go any further, please uh, give this video a like and share as much as you can. Uh, please follow me on Facebook and YouTube and visit the mathcenter.com right, for all uh, your needs in IGCSE, A-levels and IB, yeah? maths, physics and accounting. Good. Uh, we were halfway through this problem right, in the last video, so we've already found dy dx and the question goes on to part b right part b says i remember there was this curve right uh given by this equation y equals to something and now we're asked to find the equation of the tangent to the curve i repeat we are asked to find the equation of the tangent to the curve okay with this equation right and uh, at the point where x equals to negative one Again, right, you want to find the equation of the tangent to the curve at the point where x is negative 1. Not hard. You already have dy dx. Okay. So, uh, first off, uh, x equals to negative 1. I need the y value too, right? So, what is y? So, that's from here. Okay. So, I need e to the power of minus 1 squared is 1. 1 plus 1 is 2. Okay. And here I have minus 1 squared is 1, 1 plus 1 is 2. Okay, so my point, right, the point at which we are trying to find the equation of the tangent, it is negative 1 d e squared over 2. Okay, so now we need to find the gradient. So mt. What is mt? The gradient of the tangent. How do you get that? Plug in the value of x in dy dx. Easier. So plug in. So I have 2 here, right? Uh, minus 1 cube is minus 1. e to the power of, remember it's minus 1, right? Minus 1 squared, 1 plus 1 is 2. Same thing. What do you have here? This is minus 1 squared is 1. 1 plus 1 is 2. 2 squared is 4. So this 2 and the 4, let's get rid of that. And I have minus a half e squared. So now you have the point and you have the gradient. You can write the equation of the tangent. So let's do that, right? Y minus Y1. Okay. Gradient. X minus X1. In this case, will be. Okay. So Y minus this. Right. Plug in the gradient. And the X minus X1. So minus minus is plus. So I have Y minus. Let's clean this up, right? So we don't make any mistake. Minus half. E squared. Oops. E squared x, okay. This is e squared over 2 minus half e squared x, and then I have minus half e squared. Just open this up, okay. That's good, yeah. So this is gone. So we are left with our final answer y equals to minus half e squared x, okay. And we are done. Thank you very much for watching. Please follow me on Facebook and YouTube. Give this video a like, share as much as you can, and please visit the mathcenter.com, right? We have at maths physics, uh, you know, A level maths courses, IGCIC, maths physics and accounting courses, IB and so on. So please visit the mathcenter.com for your online uh, maths physics and accounting needs. Thank you very much for watching.